Good afternoon, fellow model railroaders. Uh, just wanted to give you a quick uh, overview here on uh, some of the scenery work that I've uh, been doing. So I've got this area here pretty, pretty close. I've just got to do some more uh, gravel work in there by the boxcar on that building, which is all going to be gravel. I put in this gravel pad in front of the unloading station. I gotta pull that uh, switch machine do doohickey there off yet. Uh, so I did some asphalt work and you see the patches and the rough spots because it's an industrial area and the road takes a beating. You can see what I did there. Just some patches and stuff and I did some scenery in here so what I got left to do is I got to do some ballast I do my ballast after I do my scenery so that the ballast kind of flows over top of it it's kind of the way they did it around here so anyways um, I got a poor curbs um, like I've probably said in another video I have uh, a syringe with a square end on it that's about the right size so I'll mix up some really thick uh, plaster of Paris and uh, pour it in get the air out and, uh, and then I will uh, squirt my curbs along the very edge and then I will let them dry good and then I will uh, mask off the road and with a fine brush I will paint them concrete. So anyways on this side here I uh, poured the concrete and I boo-booed with the paint a little bit so I gotta go with the fine line brush when I do my curb painting and uh, fix all that up. And so yeah, I think it looks pretty good. I'm happy with it for kind of a first go around anyways. So then I've got some ballasting left. Gravel pad in there needs to be finished. And some rail painting if I choose to and some tie painting to uh, clean up my messes there. Uh, chip that out and paint it. So anyways, I just thought I'd give you guys a quick overview before I head off to Calgary. So I will see you guys later. Oh, and remember, likes, subs, and comments are mandatory. Get on it.